Hello and welcome back to my channel. Today we're in Branson and we're getting basted. So let's roll the intro and uh, go find some food. Basted is one of those places that you hear about and you want to come to because it's an award-winning barbecue joint. I'm a firm believer that good barbecue always has some form of pig on the side. So this one definitely meets the challenge. Okay, so today we're gonna be eating some delicious barbecue, and as you can see from just walking in, they are an award-winning barbecue place here in Missouri. So I can't wait to dig in to something. The menu is pretty vast, and I don't even know where to start. I was watching kind of the plates as we walked in, and everything looked good, so I don't know. So this is what we're looking at right here. We have starters, sides, drinks, kids menu, salads, and sandwiches, and then of course we have some burgers also and specialty plates. But then there's a whole other section that's just barbecue, so not sure where to go with this. Okay, so I just talked to the waitress and she said that they have this thing, it's called the judge's plate. That's a good sampler for like a larger group. Unfortunately, I'm not a larger group. So that's gonna be too much food. So I need to find something that's gonna suit more my taste for lunch. Uh, something a little bit lighter, but at the same time give me a good selection and the options are vast. So the verdict is I'm just gonna go straight forward with this. We're gonna go with the sandwich that's called the Memphis. Now this sandwich right here that we're about to pick up is pulled pork with barbecue sauce, slaw, and pickles. And it's gonna come with house chips. But this is just gonna be as straightforward of a barbecue as you can get here. Okay guys, so this is the Memphis and it just arrived at the table. It is huge. It is so huge. I was hoping it would be a light lunch. This is looking like a full meal that's gonna put me into sleepy time. And these are their special homemade chips right here. They look like they have just a little bit of seasoning on them. Probably gonna make for a nice crunch. Okay, so here we go. We're gonna put together our sandwich and take our first bite. Maybe. Wow, this thing is huge. It's so big. It smells delicious. Oh my god. It's so good though. It's so big. Chunks of meat. Mm. This is gonna be a multi napkin situation. Okay, so let's talk about this sauce right here. So I'm gonna get a little bit right here. See this color? The color is perfect. It has a nice consistency where it drips just a little bit, but it's not too rich and deep. And overall, this flavor is such a good flavor. Mm, perfect. And let's just talk about the sandwich. The pulled pork literally melts in your mouth. As you take a bite, you get all of these flavors from the barbecue sauce and all of these flavors which have been absorbed into the meat and it just melts and it's so delicious. The problem is I have literally eaten half of the whole pork and yet it looks like I haven't even touched it yet. Oh goodness. The sandwich that goes on and on and on, guys. The sandwich itself is absolutely delicious, super flavorful, super juicy. Whenever you take a bite, it barely fits in my mouth. I probably need to squish it down just a little bit, but um, definitely not a light lunch. This is actually quite a big lunch. The portion sizes here are huge. I was telling you about that whenever we walked in a while ago. I noticed that all the plates were big. I wasn't expecting this much food for lunch. I usually eat not quite as much food for lunch, but this is also an excessively large portion. The amount of chips that they give you, whenever you really spread them out and look at them, 
It's larger than your single serving size of chips that you would get in just like a bag. It's much larger. I've already called in for a doggy bag. Getting basted definitely is undefeated against me. This is so good and so delicious, but it is so big. getting basted is one of those places that you have to stop off whenever you're in Branson. The food is delicious. The meat falls apart. There is a lot of hard work that goes into that barbecue and you can tell it from all of the awards all around that it is one of the best in Missouri. Until next time guys, if you've enjoyed today's video at Getting Basted, make sure you leave a like, thumbs up, and then also subscribe for more not only food content, but travel content. Till next time guys, bye!